That's right, Corey. You know, we usually bring you Fall Friday, but tonight we do have this exclusive invitation. We saw renovated bathrooms and living rooms. These apartments were beautiful. We went with some of the toughest critics around, tenant association presidents. They had so many questions like, what's the catch? Action speaks louder than words. Sure does. One by one, three Brooklyn Tenant Association presidents were guided by Brooklyn Borough President Eric Adams into an apartment. Adams says families who call NYCHA home should get excited. This is a glimpse, he says, into the future of NYCHA. You know, who wants to live this way? And now to walk into a clean floor, you know, and, and just move people to a living, a beautiful, you know, dry, things we take for granted. PIX11 got an exclusive invitation to tour Ocean Bay Bayside Apartments in Far Rockaway, Queens with tenant presidents. It's NYCHA's first conversion under HUD to access private capital to meet capital needs. I just believe what they say. I do. Now I have to convince my tenants. How, how is that going to go? Not very well. The HUD program is called RAD, Rental Assistance Demonstration. These presidents are hopeful, but also skeptical of private companies taking over management inside public housing. We're not going to stand behind something that is going to take homes from people. We were here in Ocean Bay in the kitchen with Mayor Bill de Blasio back in April. The same day, former commissioner of NYCHA, Shola Olatoye, stepped down. Then in June, we were with the mayor at the Campos houses on the Lower East Side, also under a public-private partnership. We asked the mayor about your concerns back then. You're concerned that you're selling off public land and that they're going to lose their apartments. This is not privatization in the sense of selling off land or losing public ownership. And the mayor doesn't like to call it privatization. He says it is public-private partnership. The biggest question that you have, the tenant association presidents have, is will people be able to stay in their homes? The mayor says yes, city leaders say yes, and of course tenant association presidents say, well, actions speak louder than words. Meantime, remember that deadline is fast approaching, January 31st. The mayor has to come up with a final plan to fix NYCHA or the feds could take over. For now, we're live in Far Rockaway. Monica Morales, PIX11 News.